Residents forced out of their homes in Grimsby say they feel like prisoners after they were told they still won't be allowed back for another six weeks. Structural work began in February on the converted mill when high winds caused it to move. Here's Helen Steele. David Needham has lived in the same flat in Grimsby for 13 years, but for the last 11 weeks he's had to call this hotel home. It's after part of the 115-year-old Victoria Mills building was deemed unsafe in high winds, forcing 77 residents to leave. They were originally told repairs would take two days, but the goalposts keep changing. Very frustrating. If you were told like six weeks maximum job, then you'd get your head around that. But you just think, how far is it going to, you know, how long is it going to go on for? And just keep hearing the same story sometimes. In some ways, you just feel like you made a prisoner in your own home, even though you're not in your own home. We just want to get back to home to, to get a normal life back together again. But it looks like even now, David won't be back in his own bed for some weeks to come. 57 flats are now habitable, but he's one of 20 people who still don't know when they'll be allowed back in. The silo adjoining the flats is a privately owned listed building, and it bore the brunt of Storm Henry back in February. North East Lincolnshire Council has taken responsibility for repairs. It says those will now take another four to six weeks. A spokesman said, following closer inspection, the repairs needed will take longer than first expected. The council has been working with residents to find alternative accommodation while the works are ongoing. But getting back into those flats for now is the priority for these long-term hotel guests. Helen Steele, ITV News in Grimsby.